Dear guests, we will now move on to the next item on the agenda pertaining to the election of the President of CAF. Secretary General, the floor is yours. We will first move to the election of the CAF President. As you are aware, three of the candidates uh, considered eligible have uh, withdrawn, and there is therefore a single candidate. And in line with Article 18.11, the candidate is approved by acclamation as there is only one colleague. Please celebrate the election of the new CAP president through your applause. Thank you. Dear President, thank you. What can I say? Congratulations. So you have uh, the microphone. Just to say some few for the General Assembly members. Uh, th thank you so very much. This is not the time for me uh, to speak. I'll be making a few remarks later. Uh, time is of the essence. So uh, I've just been asked to express my gratitude very quickly and, and go and sit down and then later I'll, I will uh, make a few brief remarks. Let me start by saying it's a huge honor uh, and a huge privilege for me. And uh, we, we spent the morning hearing the the challenges that confronts African football, and I'll talk later about what all of us can and will do together. But let me just thank my brother Constant, Presidar. Uh, thank you so much. Can we? And also thank my brother Gianni uh, for the vision and the encouragement of unity. We can only deal with the challenges of Africa, and we will succeed. But we'll only do so. We will only do so when we when we are united. So, uh, thank you so much, my brother Gianni, and uh, for your leadership, and my sister Fatma. Thank you so much, Fatma, for your leadership. And just just like Gianni, you you belong to us. You are one of us, and we are proud of the good work that you and Gianni and the rest of the FIFA team is doing globally. Uh, I have to thank uh, our host, my brother Fuzi. Uh, your football skills are uh, excellent. I was thinking I should sign you from my club in South Africa. But uh, you said to me, I can't afford you. You are too expensive. So. And also Fuzi, yeah, we can clap hands for Fuzi. And also pass our gratitude to His Majesty the King, uh, Muhammad the Sixth, and express our gratitude. And uh, may God assist him. Merci. And then uh, to thank the people of Morocco as well as to thank the, the CAF Expo. Thank you for the excellent, excellent work you're doing. You represent the best of Africa as well as the best that we have. And with you and with every one of the member association presidents, the leadership we have in Africa, the leadership we have of football in every country, it is that leadership that gives me confidence and that inspires me. And I'm absolutely confident working together, we will indeed succeed to make African football not just be the summit, but be amongst the best in the world. And uh, my, my brother Sengo, uh, my brother Yaya, my brother uh, Jacques Anuma, thank you so much. Can we clap hands for them? Eh? And as I go and sit down, just thanks to the staff and 
thanks to the people who, who really, you know, sometimes we see the problems and the failures and the weaknesses in CAF, and there are challenges. But we must also focus on, on the optimistic, on the positive, on a lot of the good, good work that many of the staff people, our committees, the governing committee, all of these, uh, the ethics committee, all of these structures within CAF that really have excellent people that who, who really try and do a good job. And we really want to, I want to express my, my personal deep gratitude. Can, can we clap hands for them, please? Huh? And of course, finally, my wife and my children and uh, all of the, we must teach our children to always remember that my father used to say to me, always remember that you are what you are because of the communities, the societies, your parents. And, and, and for us in South Africa, Nelson Mandela used to say to us, never forget that your democracy was because of the people of Africa. Thank you so much, and uh, we will talk later. Merci beaucoup.